An iron meteorite can withstand a lot as it finds its way to Earth. The journey through our atmosphere, the impact once it hits the ground. But one thing it can't handle once it's been prepped up in one of our labs is the human touch. The iron meteorites easily rust in the presence of moisture and you produce a lot of moisture in your fingers. And so we wear gloves to keep the surface from becoming rusted. Kerry Corrigan and Linda Welsenbach catalog meteorite samples for the Smithsonian Institution in Washington, D.C. They've seen firsthand what can happen to a sample of an iron meteorite once the gloves come off. This particular sample is quite old and has been handled with bare hands for a very long time. And so all this rust that you see is due to the moisture of being handled without gloves. That moisture is so damaging to the meteorites because the iron inside them is in its pure form. And terrestrial earth metals are combined with other elements to make them more stable and so therefore we can handle them. In other words, for billions of years, our earth metals have interacted with water, sulfur, and other elements and compounds to the point that now, a little bit of moisture from one of our fingertips isn't going to cause a quick reaction. But these meteorites are pure. They haven't had that kind of interaction with other elements yet, and that's a big part of what makes them so interesting. All of these materials represent the earliest history of our solar system. These are snapshots of the beginning of our solar system. So they haven't undergone any of the processing that has occurred here on this planet. And it's not just our fingers that can make an impression. Could you put that up to your face and make your make yes. face print? Do it, come on. No. <laughs> yeah, it would make a great video. For Discovery News, I'm James Williams.